So here we have the Volkswagen T-Roc on a 72 plate. Uh, I'm going to start off by hopping inside the car and running through some controls first of all. Okay, now that we're inside the car, we're going to start with the dials. Over on the left-hand side, we have the coolant temperature gauge. We then have the rev counter, the speedometer, and fuel gauge. In the center at the bottom, you can see the total miles of this car there, 9,160. The information displayed above that in the center can be changed using buttons on the steering wheel for various bits of information, various different menus available in that section, as you can see. Uh, you can also change the uh, setup of the dial, so you can change uh, the appearance of them completely as well as changing the information that's displayed in all of those sections as well and that's all done using the buttons just here we have stereo controls which continue on the left hand side along with cruise control once you set cruise control hit this button here this car is able to maintain its own distance between itself in the car and front both speeding up and slowing down automatically depending on the car in front speed and then over in the center we have the main touch screen for the car so you can access your uh, radio of course which is the menu that we're on You'll see there we've got FM and DAB radio. We've got internet radio as well. You can listen to music via Bluetooth audio, so you can stream it wirelessly. We've also got My Media, which is where you can set up your own playlist. And you have the same options available, whether you go through radio or media, as you can see just there. Pair of your phone is easy. Just hit the phone button and follow the instructions on screen from there. Below that, uh, we have, first of all, the ability to turn off the stop and start. This car is designed to cut out when it's stationary in traffic to save you fuel. The system is turned off when that light shows. We've got hazard warning lights, our parking sensors, which you can turn on and off. This car's also got autonomous parking, meaning that it's able to park itself. Uh, it will take control of the steering for you, telling you what gear you should be in and when, and of course, when to brake as well. Uh, below that, we have dual zone climate control. So you can adjust the passenger temperature, with this touch screen you can either touch it like i'm doing there or you can slide up and down same for the fan speed you can slide up you can slide down or you can use each end and just touch it once and it'll go up and down gradually uh, the air conditioning um, is on so that's off back on again or you can hit auto the car will now maintain the temperatures you've asked for by taking full control of the fan speed for you you can override that whenever you wish to we have two USB-C inputs beneath that, and then a six-speed manual gearbox. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the car for yourself and have a test drive, please feel free to call either of our MJA sites. We'd love to hear from you soon.